That, of course, is Michael Johnson, the man who lived in the Twin Cities for many years, uh, had his family growing up here, and in the late 70s had the big hit, Bluer Than Blue. Well, a couple years ago, Michael decided he was going to take his family and move to Nashville, and I remember he was on the show a little apprehensive about that yes, move. Yes, right. He had his wife and children, yeah. and really wanted to stay here, but thought he made, had to go there. And it looks as though it was the right move for him. He has since had six hits. He has a big album called That's That Out, and he's back in town for his annual Christmas concert. Would you please welcome Michael Johnson? Like a wise man chasing stars, I looked for a child, one asleep inside of me, who Christmas once beguiled. It's been two years since you lived in the Twin Cities? A year and a half. year and a half, uh, yeah. And Nashville's turned out to be good to you. Oh, it's nice. Yeah? Uh, yeah, it's fine. I mean, it's, uh, it's like being in a candy store as far as the music goes. It's grand. Uh -huh. But I miss Minnesota. I miss wild rice soup, and I miss people who know how to drive, and I miss <laughs> things like that. <laughs> in Minnesota, we know how to drive? Oh, oh, yes, I didn't think so, but we do. We do. Well, you were afraid, uh, I think, to go partially because your wife was working here. I guess she was working as a chef in Lucia's restaurant. That's right, she was. So she made the transition. Is she working now in Nashville? or? Well, she's momming. She's momming. She's momming. That's okay. it. And that's a career. All right. And she's okay with that as a full-time thing? Well, I'm not so sure about that because uh, she's surrounded by women who write books and women who write songs and women in you know, with careers, and she's beginning to get tired of, you know, cutting things in small pieces mm -hmm. for children. I'll bet you're eating well, though. Well, well of course. She's cooking course. at home, yeah. Mm -hmm. Is this true? I heard that you took a little piece of Minnesota with you, or rather a big piece of Minnesota with you? I took uh, two pieces, actually. I took a large rock, rock because, yes. yeah, Stan and I loved this one rock, so we brought it, and I, I couldn't get it out of the car. I had to get help getting it out of the <laughs> a car. A rock? This enormous iron <laughs> rock. Why? From your yard. Because, yeah. you know, you need those symbols. This is your place. You need that, yeah. Okay. And we took it and we, I dumped it out of the car and, and, and Stan looked at it and he said, Not that rock! Oh no, you brought the wrong <laughs> oh, rock! The wrong I brought rock. the wrong so I brought another one. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Now, we've heard that you are changing your sound. Now you are country singer Michael Johnson. Uh, is it true? Well, no. I mean, I'm, I'm marketed country, and I'm in, uh, involved in the country music industry, but I'm a folky. I, I love songs with, that are about something, you know, story songs. And that, I haven't changed at all. 
You know, I can't say can't. Can't? <laughs> I can't, I can't say can't. Right. And have you not noticed too, an not accent? Not too many heartaches? No or, accent. Have you noticed an accent? Do you feel you have a little accent there? Well, I said Thanksgiving last week. Uh-oh. Yeah, mm. You know, and this they do about, that. About heartache? Well, you know, country singers traditionally are talking about heartache and the, and the woman and the love they lost, and mm -hmm. that's kind of the stock and trade, right? Now, have some people said to you, Michael, you should turn more in that direction and dress differently and... Get no. some tears in your ears? No. Tears no. in my <laughs> ears. No. 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 And people in Twin Cities love the music that you do, and you're going to mm. be in concert the 26th, I once am. again, yes. at Orchestra Hall. Yeah. Okay, so if you'd like tickets to that concert, there are still a few available, and it's uh, 3715656 is the number to call. That concert is at 8 o'clock on Monday night. Yes, it Correct? is. And I'll be there. Good. <laughs> All right, Michael. They hope so. That's why they'll be there. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Good to see you back. Thanks. Good All luck. Right, continue. Thanks. Good luck in Nashville. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.